Good afternoon, Noah. This week's podcast, I'm going to share with you the scores for our recent college competition, Giving a Helping Hand. There was a good response to the competition with 67 suggestions. I have sorted through the suggestions and awarded colleges 10 points for every suggestion that falls under their college. The total points for the competition are Oxford, 160, Warwick, 140, Cambridge, 70, and Imperial and King's, both with 40. Thank you to all who suggested an idea to raise funds. Much appreciated. Next week's podcast, I will share with you the top five ideas in detail. The next part will be over to you. You will listen to each chosen idea and decide what idea you would like to support. You will then complete a voting slip stating what college you are in and the fundraising idea you have chosen to support. I will then count the votes and announce what college is associated to each fundraising idea. If you don't vote, then you may lose your favourite fundraising idea to another college. Last weekend, I went to interview Joan. He works for the Salvation Armoury. Before I play you the video, I'd like to briefly explain what Joan does. Joan is a volunteer who gives up her own time to help out at the Salvation Army in Banbury. Joan volunteers three days a week and her role varies from coffee mornings through to sorting out food donations and bagging them up. I'll let Joan tell you the rest. One. Hello, my name's Joan. I volunteer at Salvation Army in Banbury. I help in the food bank, the luncheon club and coffee morning, which happens twice a week. Joan, I've brought in today a bag of food that I would like to donate to the Salvation Army. What has happened to this bag of food? It gets distributed in bags of groceries to people that come in. They could be homeless or on low incomes, unemployed. What could we do as Noah to help you with these food banks? You could donate some groceries such as long life milk, cereals, tinned tomatoes, tinned meats, um, which could be luncheon meat or spam, which they make sandwiches with, and tinned spaghetti. Hi guys, it's Mr Stevenson here and I want to talk to you about the forthcoming End Polio Now concert. This is going to be on Thursday the 6th of March and it's going to be at St Mary's Church. It features a lot of students from our school who are going to be singing and it's for a very, very good cause, uh, the eradication of polio. And tickets are available from student services on their £5. Go and get them.